Hello friends, today we are going to see how we can start Nexus repository on your local box. So these are the series of steps that I am going to talk about in next 5 minutes. The idea of this video is to create a tidbit videos no more than 5 minutes so that you can get all the relevant information that is needed to get yourself going. So to start with you have to go to this uh, location sonatype.com downloaded OS sonatype to download the Nexus uh, installation. Extract it to a location uh, say we call it install location. In my case this is the Nexus. I installed uh, and extracted that Nexus at this particular location which we will see in a moment. After that, you need to start Nexus by running the command uh, at install location, going to the bin directory of uh, Nexus and then use the nexus.exe forward slash run. Don't miss out the forward slash because that is uh, part of the command. Uh, in certain cases, this command may eventually fail. And in those cases, you, what you have to do is like uh, uh, one of the case could be is like there is a port conflict. In those cases, you need to go to nexus.properties in the working directory of Sonatype. In my case, this is Sonatype work. You go to nexus.properties and change the port, which is mentioned here as 1981. Uh, one thing which you need to note is like this file will be created once the nexus server starts so if you try and see it in the uh, empty or extracted location it won't be available the next step will be like once the sooner type is started you need to go and log into the admin or log in as an admin for that sake uh, here what you have to do is like you need to find out the password and this is uh, one of the critical steps uh, in most of the videos that you were seeing in earlier uh, it was like old and stale content in the recent version of nexus there is a file that is getting created called admin.password when you first start up the server uh, in that particular file you will find the password which you need to log in with uh, and, and and this will give you the admin access to the nexus and that's where it will complete the process now let's get going so uh, as in order to save the time what i did is like i downloaded this file at a given location uh, in say the nexus i extracted it uh, in this particular location uh, if you see that uh, this file uh, uh, zip is having two folders nexus 3.2 and sona type work this is your working directory and this is the bin directory which i am uh, i have i opened a uh, in that terminal with the command that i have shown you guys here i ran this with uh, nexus forward slash run which will start my process at port 9081 which i have shown you here once that is finished what you have to do is like you go to your browser say localhost 9081 and you will see your nexus repository started loading here i will go and to sign in i will use the pass uh, username as admin i will go to this folder say nexus sona type work i go to nexus you see admin dot password i copy this password from here one thing i need to uh, call it out is that this admin dot password will be destroyed by nexus itself once you reset your password so just make sure that if you go and try figuring out where this file lies you will not find it as soon as we reset the password so i am going to do here is sign in and i am signed in you don't have to save this password because this is not going to be the permanent password you go and change it and this is like what it is helping you have new password i have just given my new password here and that's it so this brings to the closer of my work and these steps are finished thanks
for watching this and I'm pretty much done. Thank you. Bye.